Rudy? Are you even listening to me? Hello? Hi everyone, I'm Soe here in Rogo South Beach at the Green Carpet celebrating Musica. I'm super excited. Rudy Mancuso directed, acted, produced everything in this film. And Camila Mendes is another star. I'm so excited to speak with them and I hope you are too. with you. I'm a huge fan ever since Do Revenge. I love that film and I'm so excited to see you here. But not only are you acting, you're also producing. Yes. So what inspired you to get behind the scenes? I mean, as soon as I realized it was a Brazilian American story, I knew I couldn't just be involved as an actor. I told Rudy, I was like, I would love to do this, but I have to be involved as a producer because this story is is um, too meaningful to me and it, I feel too connected to the material. I, I really want to be a part of telling the Brazilian American story. I want to be part of that movement. And how did you give life to Isabella and how did you kind of use that for your character? I worked with Rudy for months over Zoom. Um, you know, we'd Zoom for hours talking about the character, talking about his character and kind of what drew them to each other. Uh, so I added a lot of my own personal life. I think knowing that Rudy's, knowing that this movie had, has so much to do with Rudy's personal life, I really wanted to make sure Isabella felt as specific um, and nuanced as all these characters and Rudy's life felt. So I really, you know, I tailored her to me kind of and, and brought some of my own personal experiences to, to the character. That's gonna make this film so special. And who's on your playlist besides Rudy, of course, because this film has so much to do with music. I know. Um, honestly, I've just been putting the Ariana Grande album on repeat lately because it's just, it's really hitting it for me, so. <laughs> That's amazing. And finally, what can we expect from this film? I mean, expect a really fun, um, hilarious, joyful celebration. Um, I think something that is important to note is that this movie has to do with synesthesia, which is a condition where one sense involuntarily triggers another sense. Um, so the movie has this whole other life to it. It's a musical, but it's not a musical. There's no singing. It's just uh, rhythm, and it's it's really, really fascinating and unique. I'm so excited. Thank you so much. You're beautiful, and Thank I'm so you. happy I got the opportunity to it was so lovely talking to you. I'm Rudy. Isabella. Isabella, prazer. Prazer. You do so much in this film. You direct, you act. And so what inspired you to give life to this project that includes vulnerability and self-expression? Um, yeah, I mean, I, for a very long time, I fantasized about turning my experiences growing up into a film. Because I, 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 uh, I haven't seen the Brazilian-American culture depicted on, on, um, in mainstream very often. And I also have never seen synesthesia depicted, uh, this very bizarre and unique relationship with sound and music. So the dream was always combine both, and it took a while, a long time, but I finally found a home. And I love Brazilian culture, I love bossa nova, one of my favorite styles of listening and playing. And so what's one of your favorite aspects of your heritage that you want to showcase? I think the obvious one is music, because uh, Brazilian music has so many genres and subgenres. everything from some of the bossa nova, forró, uh, batucada, funky, they're so vastly different, all within one, uh, one country, it's incredible. Um, and then, of course, the food, uh, there's even musicality in the language itself, Brazilian Portuguese is, is the cadence, is the intonation, it's very uh, rhythmic and melodic, so music, food, and the people. For as long as I can remember, everyday regular sounds, I turn into rhythm. And it's so interesting you have synesthesia. One of my favorite teachers, my English teacher, also has synesthesia. And I think it's so interesting. So what, what kind of synesthesia do you know? Was it color or sound? I think Chromesthesia? so. Yeah, she sees like shapes, and I yeah. think that's so interesting. And so does that kind of benefit you in your creative process? Um, it does when I learned how to use it as an asset. But growing up, it was very confusing and very um, challenging to to withstand conversations, to uh, upkeep my focus, and I felt very uh, out of place and, and, and different. It took many years for me to learn how to use that as, as a creative asset. Clearly, I turned it into a character in this film. Absolutely, I'm so excited, and this film combines some of my favorite things, music and cinema, so huge congratulations. Thank you so much, and good luck on all your uh, creative endeavors. Thank you so much. Thank you, I appreciate it. 
I'm so excited to be here celebrating music. I know you've worked with Rudy before, so what are you expecting? Well, I literally grew up with Rudy, 100%. 16 years, I was, wow, it's been 11 years since I've known him. That's crazy. What makes him so special and what makes this film so special? Well, what makes this film so special is that we've talked about this type of film since we were on Vine. So to see it like now live, it's just like very like he manifested this. I'm very proud of him because he's, he's, he was always, always out of all the Viners, he was always more than that. He was super, super talented, artistic and everything. So I'm very proud of him and he's my brother. 100% he knows me way too much and I know him way too much too much <laughs> like he's like literally my brother oh, that's so special and what does music mean to you music musica music means to me something universal life-changing a hobby I just like I love music who doesn't like music so yeah it's definitely something for me it represents therapy me too music is therapy yeah. I agree thank you so much for speaking with you thank you Thank you all so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed as much as I did talking to these amazing people here celebrating Musica. And make sure to give this video a big thumbs up and I'll see you in the next one.